Yep. <laughs> we got four hypers today. One, two, three, and another one behind us. Hey guys, how you doing? Back at you with another one coming from your boy, One Man's Wish. Yeah, I see it. The white BMW up there. As you guys know, I'm talking to my friends in the uh, Bluetooth Cena. So, right now we're just riding down on the LIE. Let's go for a quick morning ride after coming from IHOP. And, um, we're going to check one of our our friends who went down, the Fobra. It's my boy. Bot scared of that LIE. <laughs> hey guys, so let's talk about some things that's going on in the motor vlogging world. I'm enjoying the people, enjoying the camaraderie, you know, I like to say, yeah, loving the bikes, you gotta love the Ducati Hyper, baby, 1100, not 1100, no, 1100, <laughs> oh man, yeah, no doubt, man, sure is, good guy. Oh man, just enjoying everything. Yep. I like to let you guys know how I first came into the vote. Who I started watching when I first got into motor vlogging. First it was Bilma. How you doing there, good guy? You know. B1 by way of motorcycle. Then we have um Fire Guy 24. What's up, buddy? How you doing out there in Texas, man? You know y'all out there tearing up the roads. You are Manny and Jake the Snake. Hey, those are my guys. They on, they on that level of gentleman status, which I like to see. And my man out there in Kentucky, Sergeant Mike Markins. The guy who comes in and out of conversations. An outstanding guy, man. The greatest, the greatest heart in the world. I haven't met him personally, but I'll be looking forward to meeting him. I mean, uh... He's one of them guys I like, who cares about his family, take care of his family, and uh, basically don't take no BS. He's just like myself, but I guess in a more calmer manner, in a manner. And um, brand seven seven zero one. I like for you guys to please, if you can, go to her. Page. I'm going to put it down in here in the link. And check out uh, her foundation that she has going on for her and her daughter, Haley. Um, it's the DBA Foundation. And I'm going to try to bring as much, as, as much awareness to the situation as possibly as I can. With as much time as I have to do it. And uh, there's a number of charitable things going on in the motor vlogging community, you know, for cancer, for people who are homeless, for, for fallen soldiers, for, you know, just everyone, you know, people who fall, you know, uh, something traumatic happens to yourself, you know, these are things that you want. But let me tell you one thing that you got to have as part of your motor vlogging gear outside of everything we wear. The number one key, the number one thing to have. I would have to say is um, accidental death and dismemberment for your family and if something happens to you you're covered not just through insurance this is something totally different you know that's if you die or something else happens this is if you break a finger you know go do your research on it do your due diligence and look it up you know it'll pay for itself out in the long run trust me I learned about it through uh, the military and through the union through my union as well so um it's a great thing to look into and try to see if it's something that'll suit you in your life more than likely it will 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Watch out for that cat like behind you, Ray. <laughs> well, we're going to do one day too, guys. Y'all could talk. Keep talking. Don't worry about me. <laughs> and one day we're all going to go on motorcycles, go out here to exit 63 off the LIE. We're going to park our bikes and go uh, jump and go play paintball. Then jump on our bikes and then go home. That's how we ask the next plan that I got going on. So we're going to have an NYC paintball shootout or Tri-State, not just NYC, but it's sponsored by New York City Ducati. And, um, yeah, you know. Roger that. I see the caddy in my right. My man rolling off some blades. <laughs> That's how you do it there, good guy. Nice steady pace. I know, yeah. <laughs> There's no air suspension on that, so you know. That escalates rocking and rolling, baby. I know. That makes no sense. Yeah, I can see that. Yes, sir. Wow. Oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, Jones Beach is cool, but if you want to go all the way down to Tango, we got to take the LIE. If we're going down to Tango Mall area, we have to take the LIE straight down. Yeah, so the, well, just a ride, see the beach. Yeah, keep going to LIA. If we want to on the way back, we can pit stop or something. I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm loving the highway. I just want to get on and keep riding. That's it. Hey, guys. I know. He's, the boss is a cheap dude. That motherfucker is not going to buy it, but he will buy it. I'm not going to say that. He'll buy it, but if it's something that he really don't care about, he's not spending his money on no Cena. He'll tell you, man, you know what I could do with that? <laughs> I hear you, brother. I hear you there. Sag Harbor. Yo. <laughs> Here we see him trying to keep up with me earlier. He used to that street bike shit. See if you even ride a dirt bike, your, your upper body would be strong enough you could take it. You're used to it. Oh, anyway. Yeah, they are. All right, I'll stay on the throttle, guys. I'll keep steady instead of off and on. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, let's crank some tunes, guys. Listen to the music. 
<laughs> no, I apologize for that.